How's everybody doing? This is Roberto Valley at the world famous Colstein shop on West 58th Street in Manhattan. And today I am happy to show you and demo for you this beautiful Neapolitan vase made you know, between maybe circa 1850, 1880 with attribution to Raphael and Antonio Galliano. This vase is a full cut three quarter, you know, would be a great base for a jazz player who wants a really loud, robust sound, um, or it would be great in the orchestra section. It has a beautiful C extension that works. I'll show you that in a little while, but let's just give this a listen. By the way, the top is slab cut spruce, and the <clears throat> back and sides look like Italian poplar, plain poplar, but just stunning looking bass. Very, very comfortable to hold and play. And um, it has, I believe it has a neck graft on this bass. And listen to that. Now these are the bel canto strings that are made expressly for you know, bowing, but it does have a nice pizzicato sound. That's kind of like my warm up when I want to evaluate a bass and I just kind of hear the fifths, how they react and just hear all those notes that could be problem notes sometimes, you know, you know, the E rings true, F, F sharp, G, and the ever problematic A flat, but listen to that fundamental on that A flat. I mean, you can't maybe hear it on this microphone, but it's literally like shaking my body, just playing that A flat. And here's the, your open A, very satisfying. a jazz player, but here's the bass uh, with the bow. This bass has the organ-like low end that just spreads and fills up a room, would make a great audition bass for an orchestra, would make a great jazz bass as well. It's pretty much, you know, a bass that could do anything and everything, depending on how you have it set up. So again, we have a 19th century full cut, three quarter, Neapolitan bass with attribution to Raffaello and Antonio Galliano right here at the Colstein shop on West 58th Street. Thank you for listening. This is Roberto Valley signing out. Have a great day.